right, here we are now. Um, my name is Patrick. I'm from Germany and I'm cycling around Australia. Um, I was starting before, I was riding from Sydney to Alice Springs and then I stop and come back to Melbourne. Stay there over, I think, four, four and a half years. I was, was working, be a chef, I was working, be a car mechanic, I was a career writer and now I just, I just stopped because I want to go back to that, what I'm actually, I'm being in Australia. I want to ride around Australia on my bicycle. Um, that's my bike, it, it looks a little bit crazy, big, what the people are saying when they see my bike. But I love it. It's my bike. I love it. It's my home. Everything that I have is my bike. And with me come my dog Molly. Hey Molly. She is a... Uh... How old are you? I think she is eight months now. She is a uh, Border Collie Blue Merrill. She is not an Australian Shepherd. What many people say. She looks a little bit like that. But she is a uh, Border Collie Blue Merrill. All right, um, where I'm now, um, I'm on the way to Great Ocean Road and after this I will ride to Adelaide, stay there for a little bit, work a little bit and um, in the moment I'm in Apollo Bay, it's really beautiful here, I was staying for one day and yes, the reason is I stay for one day it's because <laughs> now coming all the big mountains and hills and everything and I want to stay, stay there one day, relax, a um, little bit sorted out my stuff, I have a little bit too much with me because that's actually everything that I have and I have a little bit too much, too much if you can see here, it's too heavy, Molly is sitting here, Molly is sitting here, there's Equipment for camera, food, tent, my clothes. How oh, I say, too much. All right, um, I'm now four days on the road already. I meet a friend. I stay there for one day. I'm passing Geelong, uh, the other way to Apollo Bay, and yeah, that's everything got many problems on the way because of too much stuff because of molly and yeah just see self Okay, I'm literally far away from my friend's home. I already got some problems. Molly getting crazy. I move from the one side to another side and the whole bike is moving to the left and to the right side when she is moving. Oh, that's making me crazy. The second problem is my dynamo here in the front. He is not charging my battery. It's already the second day. He is not charging my battery. 
I really need that power if it's no sun okay now I have sun but if I have no sun I need some power and the dynamo is charging my battery and problem number three my pedaling I don't know it's the it's the chain or something it's making a click 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 that's already four days now it's making me crazy as well always oh, click 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 I'm a little bit worried about this something break and that's will be really bad next next stop where I can fix it is only Geelong and I try to get there today yeah take a small break let Molly a little bit run Maybe she stopped them going left and right. Come here, Chad. <coughs> Come on. Go this side, Molly. Go this side. Yeah? Be a good girl. Don't eat the rubbish. And I try to fix that little problems, I hope, by getting it done. A few moments later. All right, one of the batteries have a problem. Um, I just changed the battery. It works now. Thank you. Okay, and the second problem, I just put some oil on, on the chain, clean the chain a little bit. Maybe it works. And problem number three, I never can fix because that girl here is crazy. She's jumping left and right and left and right. I don't know. How we fix that? Three hours later. All right, I'm here now somewhere in Geelong, almost end of Geelong. Uh, I got that problem with Molly on the trailer. Uh, she is moving from the left to the right side, and I was thinking about what I can do. And once I was on the pet shop, I was seeing a. a a bag where you can carry a dog and I was thinking to put that on the front of the bike maybe it changed the problem because at the moment that's the trailer now she's moving always left and right and a complete trailer moving left and right because I have only one back wheel not two and what I have changed now it's that one It's a problem now because I have that box. I have to change all my stuff now into that bag and everything in the trailer. So everything that I have built here now, I have to take it off. And it's maybe in 30 minutes to the, I don't know, dark. I'm lucky. Here was an Anaconda auto shop. And behind the icon was a pet shop or something. Now I can buy that. And it's all cost me 200, I think $230 to change the whole bike setup. Well, I can't ride, I can't ride. This is so dangerous. Always when move, Molly just moved the whole, the, the, the whole bike is just moving on the left side. But if she sit on the right side, then the whole bike moving on the right. And that's, that's too danger. <laughs> yeah, I think that one is better. It's just a problem because she cannot go in the side in. She have to go on the front in. It's really hard and difficult for her to get in. But one is cool. She can look in the top out. Hey Molly. And she have actually okay, she have less space than in the trailer. In the trailer she have more space. In the box not. And the box is not waterproof. I I have to cover it always with the uh, here with, with that shit. Um oh, I think that's better. Oh, one more issue is when I turn my speakers on then Molly get all the sound. I, I cannot. Okay. Let's Six and a half hours later.
beautiful beach. Where's the Molly? Now, the second time I'm eating, about already three days on the road. We try, maybe we will arrive tonight, Apollo Bay. I'm trying, I'm trying. Alright, I'm in a supermarket now. The last supermarket till the next big town. I so I have to buy some food for the way to the Great Ocean Road. It will be really hard. I need a lot of food and for Molly something to eat for me, some water. Yeah, my last supermarket. Then I think I have only petrol stations or something. And yeah, I don't think so. They have something right to eat also burger and chips and yeah my bike is really empty now I can ride so fast <laughs> it's amazing yeah I load everything up uh, we stay in Apollo Bay for one night um, in at a cabin I can load my batteries can wash my stuff Molly can get a shower I can get a shower really smelly and yeah, have some dinner. A few moments later. Right, back from shopping. Um, I got a pizza today for dinner. Already eat, I'm so hungry, oh my God. The whole day just packing and yeah, here. I got a nice cabin uh, where I stay for one night with Molly, take a shower, repack everything and charge the batteries and take a shower. Molly got a shower as well. Molly eating some trees I think I don't know all right that was my first vlog um, you can see I'm I'm still learning as everything new for me I never have something done like this like filming editing never I'm still learning I'm learning on the way I'm trying my best and it's not easy to to find a place to sleep to riding to move that bike the hill up and down whoop whoop and you have a dog like Molly she making always trouble. She's a troublemaker. Yeah, um, I try my best. I hope you enjoy and maybe I see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe and link. You know, you know how that works. Okay, thank you. See you soon.